in the last 20 years, uh, the Philippines has really raised its game as far as the quality of talented people, both in front of and behind the camera. Well, first of all, I, I tell everybody it's horrible because I want to I want to corner the market. I don't want anyone going but me. So I, <laughs> I just lie to everybody and just say, oh, it's awful. You don't want to go. Now, the truth of the matter is, um, before we even came, uh, we had the privilege of distributing in the United States, um, or actually around the world, uh, Hannah's movie, uh, 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 Transit. And that gave us a window into the evolution of what's going on in the Philippines in the world of cinema. And uh, Hannah's movie got us so excited about it. And then we started doing more research and, and we started seeing, uh, uh, you know, all these amazing actors, all these amazing films, these amazing uh, cinematographers and and production designers. And, and we realized that in the last 20 years, uh, the Philippines has really raised its game as far as the quality of talented people, both in front of and behind the camera. So when we made the decision to go to the Philippines, I wasn't really worried about being able to get the quality level because you guys have it. You know, I think the only thing that's that's really holding back the Philippines is that it hasn't been exposed to the rest of the world, you know. And the more people see, I mean, it's gonna it's gonna be it's gonna be a huge industry there, you know. And and you know, uh, almost paradise has only just now started to play around the world, and everywhere it plays, I get inundated with emails and DMs and and t tweets from people going, I had no idea the Philippines was like that. So, I, you know, I think that it's, it's going to change the perception of the Philippines as, as a place to go. And I already know it's changing the perception of the talent level, both in front of and behind the camera. All right, there you go. There you go. I'm ready. Everybody's cool in this for you right now. Art, <laughs> comes, is a, art comes in as a 10. And I'll tell you why. I don't know if you saw the fight scene between uh, with his fight scene and stuff like that. I didn't know the cat could fight. Um, I don't know. Uh, sorry about that. I think something just clicked off. Uh, I don't know if he I didn't know he could fight. He's just the epitome of coolness, the way he does stuff, the way he holds his gun. And he thinks a long time on this kind of stuff. He thinks a long time on it and he ends up getting it done. And the coolness of art goes a little bit above 10. Now I'm going to wow. rate, now I'm going to rate Noni. Noni <laughs> is right around a nine and a half. And the only thing <laughs> I have known is that he's just such a nice guy in real life. He's so nice. He's just, I mean, when you think of, when you think of the, the chief of police there, it's unbelievable. He's just unbelievable when it comes to that role. And that 0.5 is only because I know him in real life and he's so damn nice, it's ridiculous. Now, Sam, Sam, Samantha gets, you know, it's, she gets a 10 because she really hasn't done a lot of stuff in her life. She came into this role and nailed it. And I don't think we could have picked a better actress at the time to do this role. And I've told her that so many times and it's just, she, you know, it's it's ridiculous, man, to work with her and all this other kind of stuff. She gets a 10. Um, Sess, Sess is, I mean, like <laughs> right around a seven and she adds three more to be a 10 just because of her attitude and what she did. And I love her more than anyone else in the entire world. I just loved working with her. Anytime I got a script that it said, it's you and her, I was just like, oh my God, thank God she's back and we're going to do this stuff. And I think that actually kind of helped make the show, to be honest with you. She's the only one that really knew Alex as Alex. 
And so, you know, it's just, just hands, these, the, the Filipino actors that we got for this show, it's unbelievable, the talent that we, that we got. And, uh, and I just, I, I want to make that really known to everybody else. It's just, we got really, really, really lucky because I don't think anybody knew that there was this much talent out there and there's so much talent, it's ridiculous. Thank you.